I've been steampunked. Oh, right in the wallet. How's it going, everybody? I am the dragon as always. And I just saw this really cool game show up on Steam today called Devil's Dare. Uh, it looked super rad, and I saw that it was from the makers of Bite Jacker, which is a game that I played very briefly, more listened to the soundtrack, because the soundtrack was fucking amazing. Um, and uh, this game just looked too fun to pass up, so on a whim, I decided to give it a go. Yes, I'm sure. So, the idea... It, like, there's so many references. Benny Arcade Expo 20XDX. Obviously, we're doing the Mega Man intro. And it's Bax East. One of the world's biggest video game... Blah, 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 blah. Hey, welcome to Bite Jacker, the review show for gamers with short attention spans and fast connections. I'm Anthony, and after two years of waiting, I'm proud to announce that we are finally... What the hell? How is this happening again? So, I guess this may be a spiritual successor to Bite Jacker? Because I know Bite Jacker was about zombies as well. And just like that, the world went from bad to a total shitstorm. Man, these zombie cosplayers look really good! I mean, look at that guy! No arms! That's cute and all, but I swear, if he comes any closer, I'm gonna kick him in the nuts Johnny Cage style. Uh, I think when one guy starts to eat another, it's rather safe to assume that these are actual zombies. These adults are hopeless. Blunk! Hey, listen! I am Ivan the Red Fairy! Now if you want to survive this horror, you'll need some powers to fight back, and I am here to give you just that. In return, I expect to keep the souls of all these zombies you killed. What for? Well, to save them, of course. Now, if you ha have no more questions, let the game begin! Yay. Such a good, like, it's, yeah. Just looks so fun. I love the art style. So we got Kingston Golden Axe, Magic Tech, Twin Psy, and Master's Sword. I did play a little bit. I played as Kingston. I'm gonna try as, uh... Axel here, yes, I'm sure. So now, we've got our attack, wah, 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 and got the Triforce on our shield. Uh, let's uh, go through the tutorial. New players, I'm new-ish. Hey, listen. <laughs> hey, listen. <laughs> It's so weird to hear that in like uh, an arcadey beat em up voice. Attack, attack, attack. Dash, dash. Dash, dash, attack. Yay! We can attack. It's obviously your classic brawler. Um, like, it's very Scott Pilgrimy, very uh, Double Dragon y. Uh, very Streets of Ragey, all that, all, all the good, hey, it's a Destructoid head. All the good stuff like that, and all kinds of references. So here we've got our specials. Uh, that's a down and a, that's a forward and a, and we have to pick up the, that's a forward and a. And the thing in the what? Success! I'm listening! Breakout. So he can do attack and the special button at the same time. And that will break us out of being surrounded. So here, we're surrounded. We can do that. And it's supposed to take care of both of them. Theoretically. Doesn't always work. So we have to do this three times now. Unfortunately, when you do it, you overheat. Hee <laughs> hee. So you have to wait for that meter to go back up. A hey, coin. And now we can do it again. If... Oh, that didn't work. Come on. There we go. And that's theoretically how it's supposed to work. 
All right, so we fill up our special meter again. Da, 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 da. Wee Run around a bit. So I figured uh, I'll, you know, this game. Hey, it's Gabe and Tycho on the back there. Um, I figured I'd give this game a go while I wait for. Uh, I just got notification today that my Oculus Rift DK2 is being prepped for shipping. Yeah, tips and stuff like that. So this is like, you, it, yeah, if you have to, oh, I'm still in overheat. That's dumb. Um, God, what was I saying? I don't even know. Overheat, 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 overheat. Oh. There we go. God, that's sexy. So when you do that, it gives you food. Like that. Food. And a bunch of dollars. And there we go. Pick up all the... Oh, I guess I'm not going to get to pick up all the money bags. Or my rice ball. Alright, each level gets longer as you progress. Be afraid, be very afraid. And we can choose our direction in the road, hallway, train, sewer. That's a really weird looking hallway, don't you think? Uh, I really, really love the aesthetic on this. I mean, the pixel animation is just fucking buttery smooth. Music is awesome, as I would expect from, I mean, Bite Jacker, the music was amazing. It's still, Bite Jacker is probably one of my favorite uh, chiptune uh, oops, ah, balls. Uh, one of my favorite chiptune um, soundtracks, and the remixes in addition to it are just incredible. Wow, that took way too long. Yeah. There we go. So yeah, in the real game, you don't kill things with one special. Oh, ah! I just keep leaving the same. Oh, that was a shield charge. That was kind of neat. Yeah, I would certainly. Whoa, you seem kind of special. Or new, or whatevs. Boop. Oh. Ah. I imagine this game would be a lot a lot of fun with friends. Why does your torso extend? There's another one. There we go. That's nice. Ah! So I have no way to go. I'm just killing things in this one train car. Uh, 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 Jesus! There we go. Nice. Uh, there we go. Oh, that was stupid. But it tells you that your, your SP reloads whatever super quickly, uh, so don't be afraid to use it. Ah. There we go. I really wish that, as far as I know, Bite Jacker uh, only exists on, uh, like, fl as a Flash game, and I'd love to do a playthrough of Bite Jacker as well. Unfortunately, I haven't seen it on Steam. I hope that a Steam version is coming at some point. Whoa! Hey, fatty. I should not body shame the zombie. I know. I'm sorry. And there's another one. So I guess this whole level is just this... Whoa! One train car. Is that the first time that I've gotten hit now? 
No, it's in the first time. Oh, God damn it. Ah. I keep timing things poorly. Ah. Ow. Die. Thank you. Ah, so dumb. There we go. Ah, come on. Oh, god damn it. Okay, good. That worked. All right, I suppose. God, seriously, the pixel animation is just so smooth. And yes, this is... Oh! Mama's boy, of course it is. Mr. Voorhees. Oh! I ran straight into him. Oh my god. Why am I so dumb? Why am I so dumb? Oh, that's no good. That is no good. Okay. I am almost out of health. So, am I, I'm really, I have to attack him from behind. Yeah. Because it looks like he just kind of follows a patrol path. Oh, kind of. Oh, jeez. I don't even have enough money to revive if I die. That's what kind of sucks. So, uh, this game has permadeath. When you choose not to continue, it confirms with you that you're going to be deleting your save file. Ah, oh, balls. Yeah, so now I'm dead, and I can choose live or die. If I choose live, I have not. I don't have enough cash. And that's game over. Are you sure? Yep. I have no soul tokens, so I can't continue. So I have to game over. And that's it. That's the end of the run. Game over. Game over. Game over. So this game is kind of brutal uh, and seriously, seriously cool. Uh, I'm going to keep playing this. I'm going to try a different class. Uh, that was uh, only the second um, one that I've gone through. So uh, definitely uh, check out uh, next time when I will be playing uh, one of the other classes that are available and hopefully get further than the first boss. Um, maybe trying one of those other paths may, may lead to better luck for me. Anyway, see you then. And if you like that video, be sure to click the subscribe button up here and check us out on various social media outlets everywhere!